Hello everybody, Ivy here. How's everybody doing? I just wanted to come on here and let you see what I look like and I'm still alive. 14 pounds later, but I'm still kicking it. Um, I opened, I wanted to come on to let everybody know I appreciate you. I thank you for all the um, happy mail, happy uh, get well wishes cards, um, get well wishes gifts. And I'm truly blessed. You guys have made me um, happy and smile. And I got something, a hair, fuzz. <laughs> All right. Um, I opened this with uh, a gift that I got from um, Aaron, um, Dawn Aaron's uh, Love and Hands Creations. She made this. This is clay. It's made out of clay. And she painted it, I'm sure. She did a good job, let me tell you. I truly like it. And girl, I'm going to have to spank her because she did not sign it. I have told her many times that you need to date and sign your stuff. Because, you know, in another 10 years, I'm probably not going to remember who gave me this. You know, a mental thing. <laughs> anyway. I truly love hummingbirds and she did an awesome job and you guys she makes gnomes go to her channel I will list it below check her out give her a like a following and say I sent you okay so what um, I was talking to her through like a zoom thing and she asked me if I received a box, and I was like, no. <laughs> kind of like she knew I was getting a box. So I asked my husband, it's like, did I get a box today? So he went to check, and sure enough, there was a box. And I hope I can get through this without crying, but the first time with Dawn, I boohooed all the way through it because I really didn't think a lot of people care about me. You know, who am I? I'm just some some girl in Alabama. Who cares, you know? But I truly am blessed thinking that you guys, you did think of me. And I'm, I'm happy about that. So I'm going to do the box first. And just so you know it, this is second go around. I cried through the first one, so I had to redo it. So I'm going to try to do better, okay? So in my box... I received some house shoes because you know when you're sick you got to keep them feet nice and warm and they're pink I haven't put them on yet because I wanted to show so I got house shoes this made me cry <coughs> excuse me because I'm not a fan of real live uh, roses, but I will even cry on someone taking the time to make roses for me. And I know Amy did, and I'm not sure who the other one was. My brain is, is I don't know what the hospital did, but before I went in the hospital, I had a brain that thought just like that. Now my brain is like, what was that? I don't remember. Anyway, I will try to figure it out as I go on. But I got these beautiful roses. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I love them. So, yes. Let me get the next thing. Okay, I got the next thing because it would crinkle. and Nobody likes crinkle, right? I got me a this is so cute look how cute is that not precious I oh, love it I love it of course so it's that and it is the same on the back look how cute <laughs> yes 
yeah that is so cute I love it the next thing I know came from Margie Gabs and her name is Margie's Crafty Corner and I will list all these people that I know in the uh, description box below she gave me some paper bead stitch markers and oh my god guys these are so cute I got a little kitty cat a flower and a flower you guys need to check out her channel and look at these beads get you some beads from her they're well worth it I think they're just gorgeous just gorgeous thank you Margie the other thing she sent me is I've seen I've seen everybody doing them. Well, probably not everybody, but I get intrigued with when somebody has a craft that I've not went down the rabbit hole with, and I'm not going down the rabbit hole with this. But look at this. This is amazing. I I love when people do stuff like this. This is. Um, this is a material and it's a journal and I'm sure she done everything in here this is where you can make yourself a little note hide it in the pocket all these pages where you can write stuff in there there's pockets on a lot of them the little tags that I know she's made they're just it's, it's gorgeous um, another little um, tag where you can write things down in it so oh it's just I can't say enough of this I truly truly love handmade stuff that will get me every time look at that Margie you done an awesome job I truly love this I will treasure this forever because it's it's just something different and I will link you down below and people go check her out get you some of this stuff and what is flying all this fuzz all right go check her out oh, and I need to make room here so my next thing I got is so we know I think she likes to see me cry because um, Spitfire Dawn Erin, Erin Dawn, Dawn Erin, I call her Spitfire. Look what she made me, or got me. Look at that. It's a hummingbird. Look how gorgeous. I don't want to drop it so I'm hanging on to it tight as I can. Look at that. I love it. I love it. Oh, I love it. Thank you, Dawn. So yeah, that made me cry. A lot of stuff makes me cry because I'm a baby. And I do wear my heart on my sleeve it shows quite a bit so I'm gonna put it back in this box because I don't want to lose it and the last thing I got this made me cry too this is all the people that made this box happen and look at this I'm going to read what it says. It says, Yarn family, we, na we may not be from the same ball of yarn, but when joined together, we are stronger than ever. And yes, Erin Dawn, we are. And it's got everybody's names on it. I think Kelly was the one. That was the other one. And look at that. She made that too. Isn't she so creative? I can't keep anything straight. So look at that. 
I can name, I can read some off if you want me to. Don't pay attention to my hair. Mm -hmm. um, we have Thress. We have Flower Tammy, Dawn P, Yarning for a Smile, Sally Horner, Linda Simpson, Melanie, I don't want to butcher that name, Schmidt, if I said it wrong, I'm sorry, Yarn Art, My Precious Yarnery Angela, Lisa Crochet, Melissa Crochet with Love, um, Dawn, and she wrote Spitfire on there. I think that's so cute. Sharon Snow. Um, Ganny Joe. Timmy. Margie's Crafty Corner. Yarn Lover Regina. My little sweetheart friend. Crazy Engine Trish. Um, Miss Gibson. Debbie Piera, Kelly Milliner, Amy Long to Crochet, uh, Nancy McDonald, and Kim's Crochet and Knits. You guys, thank you. I don't, I don't drink coffee, but this will be great for hot chocolate when winter gets here. And look inside, it's pink. Yes, yes, yes. So, thank you everybody that sent something in my box that helped send, that contributed to send, to ship this, because I'm sure it cost a fortune to do that. Thanks for everybody spending um, the thoughtfulness of doing it. And so, my next one is Lisa Ladybird Love, and I call her Bird. Um, she has a smile club. Now this all started, <laughs> the very first thing I ever got in the mail was something from Miss Linda Simpson. And I thought, what did I do to get, the, what did I do? I don't, I, maybe I won something and I wasn't aware of it because I usually go to everybody's chat or live and maybe say hi or just lurk. I don't really do much in there. Um, and I, I message her right away that I will do a, uh, do a happy mail opening if, if she could wait. But I thanked her right away for it. I didn't know any of this was coming. You guys blew me away with this. Everybody did. So, Miss Linda. Where did I do in Miss Linda stuff? Right here. So, I've already opened this. Wait hair keeps getting my head away. I've already opened everything, so um, Miss Linda sent my favorite kind of yarn. How did she know that? Does she watch me? Or it was just an extra? <laughs> okay. This is Alizé, Bella, and um, look at that color. It is beautiful. Now, there is a light pink in the center, and it goes out to a coral color. Let me see if I can get, um, that's about, that's about the color right there. Now, Alizé is 100% cotton, I think. Yes, it's 100% cotton. And oh boy, we got to find all the specs on it. Okay. It is 984 yards, and let me tell you, that is real tiny writing there. Please don't ask me to uh, get a magnifying glass out to look at that. I cannot read that. And you know, 100% cotton, you're, you're not going to dry it in a dryer. You need to, uh, you know, hand wash it or maybe wash it on a low, low, uh, delicate cycle and lay flat to dry on a towel. But good Lord, I cannot read that. And I'm not even going to try. Okay. But this is my favorite yarn. Favorite color too. And I thank you, Miss Linda, so much for this. Because I was wanting to try it. I I think, um, I think I had the Bella. But I never got it in, a, in the uh, variegated color like that. But I want to try. I will make something out of it. 
She also gave me Be Kind. Be Kind uh, Keychain. She gave me some little scissors. And let me tell you, two things that I collect, and it's weird, it's just weird, is little scissors. I don't care if I go to the store. And I've already bought those little scissors before from that same store. I will buy them every time I go in there. I don't know why. And the other one is rulers. The smaller the ruler is, the better I'm, ha I'm happy with that. She also gave me a little book that says, do more of what makes you happy. Yes. And there was tape measure. I don't know what I've done with this. She gave me a tape measure. I got so much stuff up here that's ridiculous. Anyway, a tape measure. So, let me put that in there. Alright, she gave me that. And also a card. And I, forgive me, I don't know. I got so much stuff that I I, I was blown away that anybody would think of me like that. So, like I said, I may get these out of order because I'm not sure who sent what now. Um, Miss Sally Horner sent me a bunch of stuff. All these cards. Look, I never got anything from Prime before, Amazon Prime. Never got anything from them, so I didn't know. The first time I got something was from Miss Christine, and I pulled it out and was like, who sent me this? Why did I get this? I didn't even look in the bag to see that they had these things in there. I didn't. It's like, well, oh, I don't know who these are, who do they come from, or stuff like that. But anyway, I finally figured it out. I'm a little dense. But, like I said, I may get these out of order. I know Miss um, Michi's Crochet Nook sent me something. Sally sent me something. Sally sent a couple of them. Miss Christine sent several things. And I'm just going to show you because, like I said, I've probably got them out of order now. On my Amazon list, I like to do beadwork, too. So... That's what my Amazon list is. Nothing but bee work. So I got some purple bicones. And they sparkle. I got some red bike red ones. Look at those sparkle. I got some red, orange, and crystal. blues and crystals greens and some clear crystals um, some earring frames now these are the um, circles hearts diamonds and squares in the silver and in the gold tone. I got some of these. I'm a heart girl. These are hearts in different sizes. I like these places. And got these butterflies and I kept that in there and I know who this came from it's from Chabella I think <laughs> don't quote me but I think that's who it is it says Chabella on it make beautiful things from the smile club and Miss um, Chabella Bella I want to show you I'm going to only show you a couple because you get bored. So I did make some beautiful things out of it. I'm going to show you one or two. Ones that will show up on here. 
and I made some butterfly charms. They can go in your on your mirror. They can. Um, I got there's there's a little hook there where they could be hung as a pair of earrings, and they are not heavy. Believe me, they can be charms. They could be stitch markers, of course, anything you want them to be. But I've been busy. I've made a bunch of these, and that's just one that I showed you. All right. <clears throat> then this one. I think this is the one from Sally, which is another uh, earring frames that I beat around, and they are the the teardrops, the circles, the squares, and rounds. And these are green. They are beautiful. And these are crystals. Look at that sparkle. You guys, in each one of these, I think there's a thousand beads, crystals. So I'm going to be set for a while on crystals. Unless you guys find something or I find something totally opposite of what I got here. But yes, I think those came from Sally. Not for sure. But thank you. I love them. And I got things from anonymous people that didn't want to say who they come from. So this bag is full of body lotions um, from Posh. This bag smells so good. There's another one. This is a Snuggly Bunny. They, I mean, I've not opened any of it, and you can smell. This is What's Up. I'm not sure what that is. I've not heard of any of this stuff, but it smells good. Bath bombs. Mint condition. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. It says, oh, lip balm. I have not opened it yet, but I will eventually. Look at my hair. I look old. And this big bar of soap. I guess it's soap. Perfect posh chunk where you been all my life. Oh, it is a big bar of soap. That's a big chunk of soap there. That's that's huge and solid and heavy. Ooh, I can't wait to try this. And I don't know who that came from because they wanted to be anonymous. But, ouch. but thank you so much. I appreciate it. You made me smile. All right. And then I have one more. This was anonymous too. Something's going to make me sneeze. me bless me god loves me this was um a jewelry kit i got two of them i have not used them for anything because i wanted to show you their it says darn good yarn diy jewelry kit i didn't even know darn good yarn head jewelry stuff now i gotta go check them out this was anonymous and i appreciate it Well, I said it's anonymous, but I cannot read the name. I, I cannot read the name. I've tried. 
But let me tell you, I made it through it without crying this time. I just want to say thank y'all. I am truly blessed to have friends like you, family. And it still blows me away that anybody even thought about doing something like this for me. I'm just a small little person in Alabama. But I truly, truly thank each and every one of you. My heart is run over for love for all you guys. Thank you. <laughs> I'm going to cry. Thank y'all. I re also received this um, towel. It says, treat people with kindness. And that's beautiful. Very pretty. It's a lemon sage hand motion, which I use lotion all the time. And yes, it smells like lemon. And that was from Dawn P. And I don't think anyone um, will be upset if I read the card. Because I think very um, emotional. Um, it takes a lot of thought to put into a card. So, on the front of it, it says, Do you know who defines you? Do you know who controls your destiny? Do you know whose opinion of you matters the most? And it says, Find the mirror. Looks like. And it says, Ivy, we are so blessed to know you, even if it's just in the YouTube streets. You have always been so helpful and sweet every time our paths have crossed. Glad to hear you are feeling better in prayers that it uh, continues. Dawn P. Your YouTube friend, Mima D. Crochets. Dawn P. Thank you, Don P. I will um, save these cards. And this one is from. Um, let's do this one. It says, Thinking of You. It says, just a little note to brighten your day. Wanted to send some healing thoughts and positive vibes your way. I hope that all the well wishes from us are helpful, helping you feel a little better every day. Sincerely, a Yarny Sister from Lisa Ladybird Smile Club. Thank you. I don't know who you are, but thank you. And I loved the little hearts on there because I'm a heart girl. Yep, hearts. The next two are from the box that I received. And this one says, It's hard to feel blessed when you don't feel your best. And that's what it looks like. And it says, Please relax and take care. You're remembered in prayer. We all wanted to come together to show you how much we all truly love you. The names on the mug are the people who made this small get small get well box happen. We love you. Just know you will always be loved by us. Get well and you are in our prayers. Hope you like your box. To our beautiful Ivy. Yes, you guys, I'm very I'm thankful very thankful this card it says this get well card has been sanitized for your protection that's what it looks like of course there's no telling where the envelope has been <laughs> okay it says I figured you know my best I figured you know me best to send a smart Alec I think what she wrote but card but I thought you would need a good laugh. Love you, Spitfire Dawn. Um, P.S. I hope you like the hummingbird wall hanging and the mug. Lots of love and hugs and kisses. And yes. 
Thank you very much. I forgot to put that in there, so I will edit it somewhere in there. Once again, thank you guys.